All right, welcome back. In this video, we are learning how to estimate a project completion date with at least a 95% confidence level. So that's a little bit different than the problems that we've been doing before, where we're given uh, where we're given a project end date and asked to find what the probability is of that happening. For example, in the previous video, I think we looked at the, this project has an expected duration of 41 days, and they said, what's the probability of this happening in less than 38 days? Something like that. And then you give a percentage, which is the, you find a percentage, which is the probability of that happening. In this case, we're given the percentage. We're, the, the problem is uh, estimate the completion date with at least a 95%, so a 95% confidence level. So we already know that the probability of whatever Z score it is, we don't know what the Z score is, but we know that the probability of the Z score that we're going to use will be 0 0.95. Uh, so that's just giving us our 95% confidence level. All right, so what we have to do then is we go down into our Z score table, uh, which you can find in any statistics book or just Google image search. Uh, uh, Google image search, Google image search uh, Z score tables, and you'll find uh, lots there. So I just have one here. So we're looking for where our Z score, uh, where the probability is 0 0.95. So we come down here, and we just really, we just literally look for where it's 0 0.95. So it's going to be somewhere in here. And actually, look at this. We have 0 0.9495 and 0 0.9505. So let's just quickly write those down. Those are pretty important to us because the value that we're looking for is 0 0.95. This is 0 0.0005 higher, and this one is 0 0.005 lower than 0 0.95, right? Like if you, if this was a number line, uh, really exactly halfway in between these would be 0 0.95. So that's good to know. That's the target that we're looking for. So we know that, so we're, our Z-score will start out with 0 point, or 1.6, and it will actually be exactly halfway between this value and this value. So halfway, so then we have, we have to consider 0 0.04 uh, 0 .04 and 0 0.05, and exactly halfway between those values, if we had another number line, uh, and we had 0 0.04 and 0 0.05, uh, exactly halfway between that would just be 0 0.04. Four or five, right? You can do all. There's different ways that you can get this. You can do linear interpolation, or you can just kind of rough your way through it like that. Um, but the point is, the value that we're looking for, actually, the Z score that corresponds to a 0 0.95 percent probability, 0.95, so 95 percent probability, is 1.645. Uh, so we come up here. So that means Z is equal to 1.645. Five. That having that Z score will return our uh, 0 0.95, which would be found right in between these guys. So 0 0.9500, 0, 0, just like that. All right. So now we got the Z score. Now uh, what we're looking for. This is this is actually what we're looking for. We're looking for the project completion date with a 95% confidence level. So what we do know, we do know the expected duration is 41. Uh, we calculated that. And then the project standard deviation again was 2.92, just as it has been in all of these videos. So let's maybe switch colors so we can see what's going on. Uh, so we'll use this equation. So we have Z equals X minus mu over sigma. Uh, we know what Z is. We'll have 1.645 is equal to X minus mu, which is 41, all over our standard deviation, which is 2.92. If we, uh, if we rearrange that a little bit, we get 1.645. Uh, that will be multiplied by 2.92. And we'll have to add 41. And that, oh, whoops, 41. And that will return our x value. Uh, and just punching that in your calculator, um, we have our x value. This will be equal to 45.803. So the original question was, uh, what is the what is the estimated project completion date with at least a 95% confidence level? Well, it's 45.803 days or more. And the reason that we say or more at the end is, let's look down here. Uh, so we were saying that our if this if we center our mean here, our mean was 41, and we're finding this x value here to be 45.803, right? So that's mu and that's x and that's what we had our, that's what we were doing down here in the z score tables uh, this is this is saying we have a 95% probability 
that this project will finish before 45.803 days, right? So anywhere in this shaded region, uh, we have a 95% chance of that happening. But we want to tell someone uh, the completion date with at least 95% confidence. So if we tell them that it's 45.803 days or more, then we know that the project will finish with at least a 95% confidence level uh, at 45.803 days. So that right there is the number that you're looking for.